Hey, how's how's it going, everyone? This is Lewis with Nuke the Fridge. Let's awesome. nuke some fridges. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> I love that, man. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> Anyways, man, I was I uh, got to sample the show. It's so good. Oh, How you so do you much. keep up with all the characters? Oh, I'm 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 fine. I'm fine. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. At the end of the day, it's like you know we we shoot like three sketches per day, so you have to have like a moment of calm down and drink a little cafecito and like you know like just replenish, you know. Got to see three episodes, but out of all the characters, all the skits, which one stands out mostly for you? I really like playing Jekka, which is the redhead girl, hot mess <laughs> at a wedding. Just because it was just so fun. First of all, shaving my legs was really complicated. I've never done it before. <laughs> but you found respect for everybody that does it, man. It takes a long time. And I don't know how you get to the back of it. It's really, like, acrobatic. <laughs> and it was just really funny, like, because, you know, I'm, I also produced the show. So giving people really serious directions while dressed as Jekka was really funny, yeah. I usually use a mirror when I shave my legs. So oh, great. Well, there you advice. go. I should have talked to you first. <laughs> uh, do you get involved with the writing at all? Like, yes. how, how involved are you actually in the writing? Top to bottom, man. Yeah. yeah. I have a room full of eight writers, and we, every day we go into the writer's room, and we pitch ideas, and we write the sketches, and then we read them out loud and see what sticks. The, the sketches are seamless, and they're, like, short, some of them, but how long does it take you to film? Uh, what's the longest you've stuck on Oh, boy. Stuck I mean, it depends on, like, uh, there's one later on in the season called Keeping It Casual and it's just about a dude that refuses to commit but that keeps getting <laughs> married. You know what I'm saying? He's like, yo, uh, I just really need to focus on my career right now and it's like, well, and you're like at the altar like, oh yeah, 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 I do, I do and shit but like, yeah, I just, I could be out of here at any moment. And so it just progresses throughout their lives and we had to shoot that over like weeks, you know, just a scene here, a scene there, you know what I'm saying? Awesome, man. How close is it to your to your real life experiences in some of those sketches? Do people ask you a lot about Latin, Latin America? America? Yeah, a lot about it. I wish I was more informed about the like nuanced political themes in Latin America. Uh, but yeah, yeah, you know, some of the, obviously they're all exaggerated uh, for comedic purposes, but like all of the situations that you see my character go through have either happened to me or my writers. Do you laugh at your own stuff when you watch it? You know, yeah, I still do because I just like it's like I'm like it's a love letter, man. It's a love letter to, to uh, everybody that helped me create it. So I like I remember the moments and I, I yeah, I still do laugh, of course, yeah. What do you want people to take away from the show? Because I know there's an overall like uh, you know message to a lot of the. I skits. just want everybody to to know that they're welcome to the party, you know, and that uh, sort of like somebody that's different than you is not like it's not. Like, People aren't that different at their core. I think the human experience is at its core pretty much the same. So I hope that through this show you'll like laugh and build some empathy towards each other. Do you get to keep any of the cool? Uh, do you keep any I of have the cool props? The, I'm wearing the costumes underneath <laughs> this at all times. I am when I take this ball cap <laughs> off. I will be the redhead that I've always wanted to be. No, yeah, I, uh, I do raid the wardrobe after <laughs> after uh, after every week. So don't tell Comedy Central that I stole all the clothes. Uh, I mean nothing. I love it. <laughs> That's amazing. How do you keep track? Okay, what amazes me is how you guys keep track of all the characters. Like, how do you know to like turn this person in, turn the other, into the other? Uh, person? The makeup chair is really where I, where I like sort of like debrief from one to the other because it takes a bit to like get into a different makeup, maybe like a couple hours, and that's really the time I use to sort of like <sighs> breathe and get into the next one. Dude, speaking of breathing, you're gonna have a hard time breathing when you watch the show because it's so damn funny. Oh, thank you so much. Dude. <laughs> We're gonna nuke some fridges. Oh, yeah. Let's nuke some fridges, man. Awesome, man. All it's right. Nice to meet you.